Well, back here closer to home, Grove City Police say knowledge is power. This morning, officers held an active shooter response training class for dozens of adults. The class is designed to teach citizens what to do in case horrific scenarios like what happened in Chardon, Ohio, or Newtown, Connecticut. And as 10 TV's Ashley Barry reports right now, these new tactics may surprise you. Let me in, open the door. This is only a drill. Let me in! Lockdown, lockdown, lockdown! But it has the feel of reality for these Grove City residents. I know you're in here, where are you? The ear-piercing shot and frightening scenario left some still shaking after it was over. You could hear it coming, you knew it was coming, but when it was there, it really, really made you feel vulnerable. You knew there was nothing you could do. I mean, you knew, it was, you knew he was gonna probably break through the door. And it just, like she said, it's real scary. Just, just, there's nothing you can do to stop it. But Grove City Police say this active shooter response training is designed to prove that common theory is wrong. A series of exercises and even a movie clip showing what happens to innocent lives when you do nothing left students shocked and saddened. It's just a reality. There are violent people in the world. And if we can train and provide some information to as many people as possible, hopefully that'll swell. Students are told the worst thing they can do is take no action. Immediate response is key. So if they're trapped in a room, they're told to use anything at their disposal to keep that intruder out. Somebody needs to take leadership, right? Well, let's go, everybody! And in less than a minute, the door was secure and the threat removed. If you don't have those seconds, then you charge. Hiding is one of the last things you want to do. If you can get out, get out. If you have to fight, it's a fight for your life. And you have to be committed and dedicated to that action. The primary goal is that these citizens never have to use what they've learned, but instructors say if they've learned it, they have a much better chance of survival. Reporting in Grove City, Ashley Berry, 10 TV wow. News. And if you are interested in finding out more about the active shooter response training, you can contact the Grove City Police Department.